You know where you are. This is Nollywood Pictures TV. You were highly recommended for this job. I hope you will not fail me. I was in the army. I smoothly accomplished many military tactics. This is not a job for me. It's all right. Um, you have this. You will find pictures and addresses of, you know what I mean. If you come with good news, I will reward you handsomely. Okay? Consider it done. But remember, I don't joke with my money. Ah, come on, young man. You of all people should know that money is not an issue where I, the king, is concerned. Okay? You just do a clean job. And I can guarantee you, I can even give you three times the amount we agreed, okay? You go. I'll be on my way. Come do the job. Thank you. What? You mean you wiped out an entire lineage? My son, that was the greatest massacre that this land has ever experienced. Well, but um, with the help of the chief priest, a huge sacrifice was made and uh, the whole tension died. Was the chief priest in support of what you did? Well, he wasn't, but uh, he had no option. He had to obey me and uh, make sure that the secret is kept. However, I did some other things in order to quell everything. All right. So, what is happening now could be karma finding its way back. Karma obeys the gods. If you make peace with them, karma will have no hold on you. Have you ever wondered? Why kings do a lot of atrocities and they go scot-free? It's simply because they appease the gods and the gods keep karma away from them. If I appease the gods now, all this will stop. You should have appeased the gods long before now. This shame would have been averted. Well, the chief priest refused to perform the sacrifice, you know. And uh, I had to travel to Njama Kingdom, our neighboring village, to meet their chief priest, who agreed to help appease the gods. He's holding it. It should be done as quick as possible. Well, you're correct, but um, the requirements are not yet complete. I'm hopeful. Very soon, they will be complete. Why did you say that I would die if you allowed the Ode Festival to take place? Your Majesty, there has been a heavy revelation from the gods. And it is pertinent that you hear it. What is the revelation? Say it. The gods said. If you introduce your son as your successor on the day of the Odi festival, he will die. You are a liar. My son will not die. The words of the gods cannot be disputed. Udoma, those words are not from the gods. Now, tell me the truth. Are you by any means I in my throne? It will be a sacrilege for me to do so. I am the mouthpiece of the gods, and that I remain.
You talk to me as if I know nothing. Now let me remind you, I am the great king of Amaji Kingdom. No one, I repeat, no one can sit on this throne except I hand over the staff of authority of this kingdom to that person. If you think that I will hand over the staff of authority to any other person apart from my son, then you have another thing coming. You have stained this floor. The gods frown at you. Then tell me. Tell me how we can appease the gods. After all, you are the chief priest. The gods did not permit me to do so. In that case, you have no business here. Now leave my palace and never come back. Leave! What are you still waiting for? That was how I sent him away and ordered him not to come close to the palace again. Father, you shouldn't have thrown him away. I'm sure if both of you are still together, he would have found a way out of this problem. Ah, no, he won't. As a king to be, you have to learn how to read the handwriting on the wall. That way, you will know when to move or stay. At a point, I noticed that um, he was opposing my orders and was no longer carrying out my instructions. He started telling me things that I am sure were not from the gods. That was when I knew that he was working with some bad people to take away the throne from my family. Father, are you sure the chief priest of Njama will find a lasting solution to this problem? I sense fear in your voice. Kill that feeling. That is if you want to be a king. My son, the future of any kingdom lies in the hands of the king. Well, after appeasing the gods, I will reshape this land and abolish any tradition or deity that contradicts my wish for this kingdom. What took you to that kingdom? Not even in the village, but in the palace. Mama, do I need to say this over and over again? I told you that I love working in the palace. You know that about me. So why are you still asking me? You're no longer going to do that job again. Why? I I'm no longer comfortable with your job. Comfortable? Well, how? Didn't I tell you I've been promoted? I'm no longer the gate man. How do you think I've been getting money to, to be doing all these things in, in, in this house? Mama, please don't go there. Or please, don't, don't even go there. But Mama, come to think of it. That job is not really bad though. Hmm? Brother, he has been taking care of a lot of things in the house. He's been using the money he gets from there to take care of us. Will you shut up? Shut up! Ken Kema! What do you know? Only Fema! Brother, I'll be taking care of you. Must you take a job because the pay is high? Eh? Before you take any job, you have to kneel down. Ask God to reveal the secret behind the job to you. To be well here. He's no longer going to work there, Omangakwa, unless he will kill me first. Mama, what, what do you mean? I am the personal assistant to the heir apparent to the throne. When he becomes the king, do, do, do you know what, what that means? Eh? 
What could possibly happen to me in the palace where they have security all over? Also, okay, we're a personal assistant to uh, God. That is what makes sense. Mananka, personal assistant to her apprentice to the throne. Okay, for portal. Let me tell you, I have been having serious nightmares concerning that uh, palace. So I don't want anything to happen to you. You are my only child. You are my only son. What will happen to me now? It's because you've been thinking a whole lot about the palace. You've been thinking. That's why. Nothing will happen to me. See, eh? I have already told your uncle to get a job for you in the city. Akwe for the palace, huh? you are no longer going to work there unless you will kill me. Talk to your brother, Akwe. You are not going back there. Did I tell you I need a job? Please do. You people are spreading fake rumor about the palace simply because you want to bring the king down. <laughs> Will I, a title chief, condemn my own king just because of uh, no tangible reason? Look, I saw Adaisi run mad even before the king and his wife. I witnessed it firsthand. This sounds very dirty to be true. I mean, what could make a member of the royal home go mad? It is impossible. Very impossible. Nemesis is befalling this land right under our nose. And we are all keeping quiet. I think we should force the king to say what is going on. Did you say force? <laughs> Did you hear yourself talk? Is there a bit, are you okay? I'm very okay. Let us at least mobilize the youth to host a protest against the king. The king must tell us what is happening in this community. I will not be part of this dirty plot against the king of the kingdom. A king that has been good to every person in the kingdom. Agreed you could have some flaws. But that does not mean that we are all clean. No one is perfect. Neither you nor I. I am out of here. <clears throat> I will not be part of this too. I'm leaving two of you. Mm. Our former. Man. Oh, Even go. you. Yes. Our former. Man. Ah! Let them go. go away. We know what to do. Man. Yes. What I've been told. Let yes. them go. Let them go. Oh no, I have the gods. Your heart is heavy. Yes, indeed, my heart is heavy. Some people are rising up against the king. And I don't think it would be fair for you to sit down here and allow that to happen. Oh no. Are you aware that the gods are not happy with the king? Yes, I am aware. But it is not for us the subjects to discipline the king for offending the gods. Why protest against the king who has done well to his people? It is unfair. Oh no. Only the gods know what is fair and unfair. But take this home. A mighty rain is about to fall in Amaji. It is time for every man to go into his barn and count his yams. Because you never know how many you will lose when the time comes. And the gods. What is it that can affect us like that? What have we done? The gods cannot be unfair. No man can harm who is at peace with his chi. Keep that at the back of your mind. Of the gods, I have heard you. Obidi, Aneloka. Chichi, I greet you. Welcome. 
Thank you very much. You are the most influential youths we have in this land. There is a big problem that we need your influences to act on. Chie, what is the problem that we don't know about? Mm, yes, I believe that uh, this land is the envy of other communities. Yes, Ichie, talk to us. What is this big problem you are talking about? Have you heard of the Ode Festival before? Yes, my father told me about that festival, which I've been looking forward for. That is just the problem. <laughs> you see, the king avoiding that festival means there is something he's holding that he's not telling us. We have discussed this and praised for the king to do this festival or to tell us the reason why he is food dragging on doing this festival. But he has refused to talk to us. I mean, that's not a big problem. If the king has refused to do the festival, I mean, that means it is not important. You won't understand. <laughs> you will not understand. That is just the problem. Yes. A very big problem. How? Now, let me tell you. His refusal in doing that festival means that he's holding a secret against this land that we need to know. Ichie. Yes. What do you want us to do? Mm. Good. Tell us. Okay. What do you want us to do? Mm. You see, uh, we might not be able to fight him. For he is the king. He can decide whatever he wants to do. But we can protest against him. Yes. You see, we can make him know the power of the masses. Oh, yes. Just mobilize the youths. Yes. And let us show him what the strong power of the, of the masses could do. <laughs> what is funny here? It is. <laughs> Ichie, listen to yourself. I mean, did you hear yourself speak? Wait, 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 wait. Ichie, so you want us, you want us now to lose the little respect we've managed to gather from these people. Right? But this is what is beneficial to all of us. I mean beneficial to all of us. So, two of you are the enemies of the king. Mm. Yes. yes. No, 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 no. You are getting it all wrong. You are getting it wrong. Eh? Look. Look at this man. We are fighting for the good of the masses and of this land. We are fighting for the good of the land. I cannot believe this. So, the both of you want to use us mm -hmm. to protest against the king. A king that favored every single member of this community, including both of you. Of you. Huh. you two are evil. Sorry. You are evil. You are getting it all wrong. You are getting it wrong. We are not evil. Mm. So what the, are you? the truth of the matter is this. That, that the king 
might be concealing a secret which might turn out later to haunt the entire community. That is the dangerous aspect of this. <laughs> Ichi. Ichi. Yes. I have marked your faces, Ichi. Anything that happens to the king and the royal family, the youths will hold you responsible. We will not take it lightly with you. We are not quarreling with you people. We are just laying our mind. We are, Let's leave this we are trying to you are evil tell you something that is important. Evil men with red caps. Evil men. Look, look at the both of you. See their caps. Let the Think about it, oh. They might not understand. They might not understand. That is but the problem. Time will tell. Yes. Zuba, I think I like this your new job. Very, very easy and the pay is good. Yes, sir. Mm. <laughs> I'm more like the prince's personal assistant now. All I do is to advise him, you know, and follow him around with a good payment. Is it not good? You know, I frowned that you go into that place to work as a uh, uh, And I know Mama would not be happy to hear that that time. That's what I was telling you people that time. At least you must have to start from somewhere. Look at me today. But the problem I'm having right now is, is Mama. Mama is just giving me a headache. She doesn't want me to work there. I don't understand. Didn't you tell her that you're no longer the gitman, that you've been promoted to the personal assistant? I did, though. I told her. But well, because of her constant nightmares and all of that, she's just against it. No, no, no. You have to talk to her. You don't have to miss that job. Me, I even want to work in that palace. My brother, I have spoken to Mama. There is no how I have not, in fact, made her see reasons with me, but she's just against it. So this is the part you need to step in. Come and help me talk to her. Let her see reasons. Let her understand that this is a good opportunity. Golden opportunity people have been looking for. Please. I can't lose that job because of her. I can't. What if Mama's fears are right? Huh? What if there is something scary about that job that you don't know? How? That job is too lucrative to be real. You know, my father once told me that I should not drink water because it's served in a golden cup. Content of golden cups are not golden as the cup. You have to think about it. Consider what you've seen so far in that job. I'm not that one to become bamboo. You must pass through fire. No one picks up a dead lion right in. This compound and they may know only the gods can do that to you. Makadioti adia kosi for funu nenu. Abelo me buraji eji chaja emesi age bume. Nzube chima mo nzube. Nzube chima mo. The gods loves you so much. Is this Apollo or Zima? The former. Brother, brother, what is it? You've been moody since you came back. Talk to me, what is the problem? <sighs> this life. I don't know what women really, really want. I saw a former. Brother, forget about that girl and move on. Since you started dating one useless guy like that, she has been misbehaving. 
Please forget about her, Joe. Honestly, I am heartbroken. That girl gave me the impression that she cannot live without me. She made me believe that she's so much in love with me. Huh? Be because of what? Even if I walk where they pack feces, is, is, that, is that why she will give up on, on our love? Huh? Is love not for better for worse? What did I really do wrong for her to leave me like that? Ha! Brother. Mm -hmm. Brother. Thank God that that girl left on time. Mm. You see? She has shown her true color. Ha! Brother, that girl does not really love you. Mm -mm. She does not love you. Because if she truly loves you, she wouldn't leave you. Or probably, okay, let's just say she will leave. But at least, whenever she sees you, she's supposed to accord you some respect. But no, she wouldn't. So, brother, you should be thanking God for saving you from future problems. Ah. Hello, sir. Yeah, good afternoon. Um, there is something I just found out. I think you have to come back. We we'll have a lot to discuss. Oh, okay, okay sir. Y you want me to start coming now? It's already late. Uh, you have to come back tomorrow morning. First thing tomorrow morning. Tomorrow, okay, okay, so I'll, I'll come tomorrow. Very first thing. You are going nowhere. Hello? Please, I don't know who you are, and I don't want to sound rude to you. My son is no longer coming to work for you. Go and get I, another I, I, man. Did you hear me? Who is this? I, I, I am. I am his mother. I am his mother. Leave me alone. Get, my... get another gate man for yourself. Give my phone. Mom. 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 What is she saying? What is wrong with you? What is this now? What, what, what is the meaning of this? This is wrong now! This, this, this is wrong! What is wrong? Is it Jesus Christ? Can't I talk to him as I want? You are no longer going to that place, so you are not going to work for them. I will not forgive myself if anything happens to you. You are my only son. Eh? I have, I, I, they have shown me everything about that palace. Oh you know what I'm saying? Whatever happens, you are not going back. Talk to your brother. Unless you want to kill me or you want to beat me, you are not going there. I don't know why my mind is like this. See? You, you, you better talk to Mama. You better talk to her. You better talk to her. I, I, I won't take this next time. What, what, what's the meaning of this now? But, but brother, come to think of it. Coming to drag my phone. Brother, 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 calm down. Hmm? But come to think of it. Whenever you see Mama behave like this, that means she's sure of her feelings. Are, are, are you mad? Are you are you mad? We, 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 what, what kind of stupid feelings? I to leave, leave this lucrative job for what? What kind of stupid feelings is that? Okay, 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 brother, calm down. Calm down, okay? I don't even know what to tell the prince. Brother, brother, calm down, please. Calm down. Okay, even if you have to go back to the palace, you have to pray to God and ask for his directions. Hmm? Okay, you have to pray to God very well. Please, enough of this. Please, please, God please direct enough you. of this first. Ah. Oh, it's the